Good evening. Tonight, law enforcement agencies across the valley are on the lookout. People are coming across the border in greater numbers than previous months. Channel 5's Galina Cruz spoke uh, with a valley constable who's seen activity firsthand. It came as no surprise to see an uptick in people crossing the border illegally for Precinct 3 Constable Larry Gallardo Jr. The area he patrols covers a quarter of a mile on the border. Gallardo says it was just a matter of time before the next rise in apprehensions. Like a roller coaster, the plotted numbers reflect peaks and valleys. It's a ride those living along the border witness from the front row. Well, in 2014, as you remember, we had thousands and thousands of illegal immigrants coming across, uh, especially between Alza Duas Bridge and, and Alza Duas Park. Less than two years later, a 180 turn left the once flooded corridors empty. Before, you know, there was two or three or four or five. The rickety downward trend reached one of its lowest points in border apprehensions earlier this year. But the ride wasn't over. Now it's 30 and 40. Gallardo jotted down numbers for this month so far. Apprehensions surpassed the hundreds. 90% are OTMs, or other than Mexican descent. Gallardo is one of several agencies seeing the numbers pile up. Last week, Border Patrol reported apprehending 86 people in Westlaco who crossed the border illegally in one day alone. Gallardo says it's hard figuring out what creates the wavelength trend over the years. I guess the fear of not being able to come in. For a man who knows what each season brings, he warns an increase in apprehensions means people may go undetected by law enforcement and risk facing the dangers lurking in the journey north. No water, snakes, you know, they get bit, they don't have any medical attention, it's not there right away. So, I mean, hopefully by detaining them along the border, we're able to save a human life. And I think that's important. Gallardo emphasizes the fluctuating trend is part of life on the border. It's only a matter of time before another wave hits. Gallardo says there's only so much law enforcement can do once people attempting to cross the border illegally reach the Rio Grande. He says other countries need to do their part in stopping illegal immigration. In the studio, Carolina Cruz, Channel 5 News at 10.